as a black man, I'm subject day to day to racial profiling from society, police officers, and people of my peers. One particular day I was driving, coming out of the Family Dollar parking lot, and I seen an officer parked on the side of the street. As I was passing the officer, he started following me for no apparent reason. I let him follow me for about eight blocks. And after the eight block, I pulled over to the side of the road. And when I pulled over, he turned on his lights at that point. When he came up to the vehicle, he had his weapon drawn. He had a trainee with him. The trainee came on one side, the passenger side, he came on the driver's side. And he asked me for my registration, my license, and my insurance. Um, so I gave him my license and he ended up giving me a $400 ticket. So I went home and called the sergeant and the sergeant called him and sent him back out. I showed, when I showed him, the car was up to date with the sticker and I re-showed him my insurance. And he said, I don't know how I didn't see your license plates being up to date. So then he went on to say, I'm not racist. I've been on the force for 20 years. And as he was talking, the trainee was just shaking his head the whole time because the trainee knew that he was wrong in the pursuit of uh, following me and stopping me and giving me the tickets. So when I, um, I asked for the sergeant to come out, I didn't understand why the sergeant didn't come out, but he sent the same officer to my house. I felt that was a threat. And, and the sergeant never even called me back and said anything. But the officer that came out that gave me the tickets, he said I could just tear the tickets up. I don't understand how I could go to a person of authority, but he sends a one out that committed to act. I don't think that that was fair and I believe that that was injustice as well. 